Continue today for possible skeletal remains in East Shelby County. Friday, Shelby County Sheriff investigators discovered a human skull near Canada in summer in Lakeland. Today, they found even more evidence that a body at some point had been left there. Fox 13 Scott Mattis was at the scene as they searched for more clues. Using four-wheelers and rakes behind these gates early Sunday morning into late afternoon, nearly 30 members of the Shelby County Sheriff's Office gathered in this wooded area after discovering a human skull here Friday. Anytime that uh, you, you find human remains like that, it, it's certainly a crime scene. And because of that, investigative teams sectioned off the privately owned property using search and rescue canine to find more pieces to the puzzle that have detectives wondering who the remains belong to and how they got there. The skull was just resting uh, there in the woods and um, again some of the, the bones that, that uh, the detectives and the emergency services workers found uh, nearby were just kind of there along with it. All the way up to the Sunday's weather on the wet side made work for Shelby County Emergency Service crews tedious as mud soon outweighed sheer water, but it was the moisture that aided the specially trained dogs as they looked for more human remains. When they do find uh, such as bone, human bone, human remains, they will stay and bark or lay down, but they do not destroy or touch or pick up, but they find. And find they did. Big. Sunday afternoon at Patty Woods Lab, Angel found what deputies confirmed for us to be even more remains. But the questions still remain for investigators. Who is it and how did they get here? A question the Shelby County Medical Examiner's Office is working to answer. The most important thing we have to remember now is who is this person? We know that they're related to somebody and we know that anybody that has someone from their family who's missing, uh, they're obviously very, very concerned. Could this be my relative? In Shelby County, Scott Mattis, Fox 13 News. Now, 20 bones have been discovered at the site since the search began Friday night. Fox 13 attempted to speak with the property owner, but the owner wasn't home when we arrived. Deputies say the owners are cooperating with the investigation and do not believe they are involved. A South Memphis man.